Yeah, frustrated. Obviously, the players are really disappointed in there. They wanted to put a good performance on that. They did on Boxing Day up at Darlington. I think um, you know credit to da to Darlington. Um, they played better than they did the other day. Um, I think we were were anywhere near the levels we were the other day, which is disappointing. Um, but I think for the first 10, 15 minutes we started okay. We started quite well, and then um, you know when they played the quick free kick down the side and caught us out a little bit and Beck got the first goal at the bat stick. And then um, the second goal, the big clearance for beat our whole defence and views clean from goal and Hazel lobbed us, lobbed uh, crackers. We were we we're down to two, two nil and um, you know we, we started to have a little panic up a little bit. Um, but then second half, I thought we started 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 okay. You know uh, I think Cooks has had a couple of chances mm -hmm. where could if you, it t takes both of them, it could be two two. And then obviously the handball decision for the third goal. Clearly, hand balls it into his path and um, and scores, and the linesman doesn't see it. So, um, you know, a bit of a killer blow, really. And then we had the interruption, you know, with the the referee and linesman. And then, um, you know, it's always difficult to get the boys going. We we, we try to get them going, change shape, brought a few players on, um, and then obviously the fourth goal goals killed us. You know, where uh, the foul on Will should be a foul, and then. Um, you know, the free kick you can't really do much about it goes in the top corner. So yeah. you know, it's always difficult being five 0 down. Um, but what I would say is, you know, we got ourselves together. Could have been six or seven. Uh, we get two goal goals back through Kula. Kula's first goal, really good finish, and then obviously the penalty um, sends a keeper the wrong way. But I think the biggest thing for me today is, you know, uh, before the game, there's a lot of expectation because. You know, we're right up there. If we win, you know, we've got one one point behind the top of the league. Um, but we're playing against a team who's been in the league a long time. Um, got some good players who played in football league, um, and um, today probably they were the better team. You know, sometimes you've got to take take your hat off to them. Uh, they were a better team, um, but we didn't perform at the levels we know we can perform, and um, that's the disappointing thing. And the players are really disappointed. But what I would say is that. You know, um, everybody said at the start of the season we're going to be um, getting relegated. So we're in fifth position, we've got a game in hand. We win that, we're still two points off the top. We're eight points clear, um, safe in the playoff zone. So there's a lot of positives, uh, a lot of positives. Yes, we've had a bad day at the office. Yes, we haven't played like we want to play. Um, but there's um, what I would say about this group is, is they always have a reaction. So I just said to them in there, listen. Put this to bed. Um, Hereford away at the weekend, and um, every time you've had a blip over the last 18 months, you've always reacted really well. So let's uh, react really well against Hereford. Yeah, one positive as well, John. That's the biggest ever crowd that's played at Scarborough, and you guys have done that, and your players and your staff, you put that together. How does that feel? Yeah, I said that to the players before the game. I said to the players before the game. I think my first home game 18 months ago, there were 670 people here. Yeah. So I said, it's credit to you players, but. Now we're playing against Darlington, top of the league. You know, three thousand two hundred people here sell out. It's all down to you, your guys' effort and work rate and determination to put good performances on and win games of football. Um, and it's all down to you. Um, and the fans were superb. I thought the bats them all away. Um, it's easy, you know, when you're three or four nil down to turn on your team. But I thought the bats them all away. Mm -hmm. And um, credit to them for coming down to support the lads. I think. Um, that's why the players are probably so disappointed in there is because the last two times we've had a full house here, we've done well, you know, the semi-final of the playoffs and yeah, the final yeah. of the playoffs, and today we've lost a game. But um, what I would say is, you know, we've lost a game against a team who have been at the top all, all year. They've been in the division a long time. They've got some good quality players, some good experience in there. We're, we're a team still, still building, st still trying to get better, but what we've got a great group of players, you know. Yeah. Um, they always put a shift in. Um, you know, there's never any lack of effort or anything like that. You know, you can always excuse mistakes when you've got such a, a good group of players, really. Um, they know they've played um, not as well as they can do. So um, there's still loads of positives, 100% loads of positives. Busy month coming up as well. How are you looking player-wise? Any injuries, any niggles? No, I think we're all right injury-wise. Uh, Jake should be back in a week or two, fingers crossed, from his shoulder injury. Mm. Um, so that would be like having another sign-in. Uh, we're probably still looking to get a, a player or two in because Planty and Dan Bramall are leaving. Um, so yeah, we're in good place. Um, loads of games coming thick and fast. We'll do our utmost, utmost best to stay in and around it and um, try and be the best we can. You know, 
you know, even when things are going well, we always say about taking one game at a time, and that's all we do is one game at a time, concentrate on the next game, mm. the next game, pair for the way, try and put a better performance on, and if we do that, hopefully we'll get a better result. Cheers for your time, Donna. No problems.